Here's one way of releasing package bees in really ugly weather. I used insulated equipment, I practiced with Mylar blankets, and I actually used common quilts. And after using the slow release technique, a day later, with my heart in my throat, after well below freezing that night, I went out to have a look. I removed the blanket. I had put the cage there sideways. I didn't shake the bees out. It's, uh, it's a warmer day now. The bees can fly. Very quietly, I wanted to, to cause the least disruption possible, but I wanted to relieve, to relieve them of that cage and to do a few other things like check the sugar syrup supply and to be sure that the queen is okay. I need to tell you again that it's really getting cold and rainy and snowy at night. So I wanted to keep up. I enlarged, enlarged the holes in the feeder can and then I set the can on common soda straws just to give the bees some space underneath. I had a, a quick look. Some of the fondant stuck to the cage. I had a quick look at the queen inside the cage. Thankfully, she's still there. It looked okay. The bees seemed all right. Everybody was healthy. There was not a lot of uh, unusual number of dead bees. Some of the bees from the package are shown there dead, but that's just normal wear and tear. So close everything up. I put, the, I put the straws back on the cage so that my top blanket wouldn't press down hard. I wanted the bees to have access to that queen cage. So just out of view almost, I put the blanket back on top of everything. It's uh, about 11 o'clock in the morning, so they've still got some sunlight and heat for the day. Close that up. And then leave it alone. Go back inside and just worry during the cold night. I came out the next day and had a quick look. Just a quick look. This is all I did. Everything seemed okay. After six long days of basically waiting, I really didn't bother the bees all that much. I came back out and removed the top blanket. And removed the Mylar film. I'm still going to practice with this. I have no idea if it's helpful or not, but this, is, uh, this film is a unique product. Had a look. The queen is still there. I release the queens directly. I, I want to know that they're out. So if you're a new beekeeper or new to beekeeping, do the slow technique right here. Watch. The, right there. You can see that orange abdomen of that queen as she goes down. So that's what I was looking for. I know she's in there. I know she's released. I put the Mylar film back on top this time, and then I'll just use the regular quilt to hold that in place. And then close everything up. And basically, during some really ugly weather, I've released those queens. I've released those package bees in Brooktopia.